On this channel, I show you basketball plays, drills, and skills. So if you like that stuff, hit that like button and subscribe. Today, I'm going to give you some fantastic basketball plays that you can use at the middle school level. Heck, even at the high school level, you can use these as well if you're playing up against a slower basketball team. Or if you're just if your team is just faster than everybody, these might be the plays for you. Let's get down to the clipboard and let's check these out. Okay, so first in this basketball play, what we're going to have is player 3 and player 1 coming together for a dribble handoff. Once player three gets that ball, what we're going to have is player two running up towards the, the like kind of like the free throw line extended slash 45 degree angle, and player three is going to be passing player two the ball. What we're going to be having now is player four. He is going to go and set a screen across, and this is going to be a staggered or double screen for player one. Player one is going to use that screen and he's going to be popping out towards this wing. Now he could take the mid-range or three-point shot if he's open. If not, but he does get the ball. Player four is now going to set a screen for player five and player five is going to be using that screen. Now he should be open in that low post to ca catch that ball very quickly turn and shoot for that layup or nice bank shot from the mid post. Now we're going to move up a bit higher with our 1-4 our offense and do a quick high 1-4. And what we're going to be looking for here is player 5 is going to be setting a screen and roll with player 1. Now if they switch and player 5 is open for the layup, definitely give it to him. However, if he's not open and player 1 fought through and player 5 is able to follow, what we're going to be looking at now is player one to do a dribble handoff with player two player two is going to get that ball and what we're going to be having now is player four setting a screen for player three and player three is going to be using that screen and he's going to be cutting out and across the key and if he's open for that mid-range shot or even the layup definitely give it to him if he's not open then he's going to continue out towards the far free th three-point line and we're going to be having now player five setting a back screen on player four player four is going to use that screen he can go in front or behind it doesn't matter and he should be open for the layup now of course this is middle school plays for teams that are able to run offenses and have the knowledge to be able to be able to run somewhat complex offenses like i am showing here now let's go over to a quick simple play really quickly so that we can accommodate for teams that not necessarily can run comp more complex plays like these. So you're probably thinking, okay, these are pretty complex plays. It's a middle school level. I, my team isn't advanced enough to be able to run plays like these. Well, we're going to set up a five-out offense. Of course, you could just do a quick five-out pass and screen away or pass and screen for or pass and cut. If you're wondering what those offenses are, it's very simple. Pass and screen four, pass and screen away, and then he would fill and cover, and then pass and cut which would then everyone would fill over and he would fill out that's just a quick summary of course i've ran the five out in multiple different videos you can find it all on my channel and if i remember i will i will link them in the comment section below however we can run a quick set offense off of this and this is basically a nice quick and simple screen down they're going to be popping up now if one of those two players are open hit them up for a shot if not once they're up, they're going to be cutting across. Let's say neither of them were open, and one of them will have their hand up. Let's say player two has his hand up right now. He's going to be stopping at the elbow, and player three is going to continue through using player two as a screen. Player three is going to receive that ball, either in mid-range or three-point line area, and player five and player four are going to be crashing the boards because he's going to be jacking up that shot. And player two, once he sees player three get that open shot, he's going to be crashing the boards as well now i know what you're saying dude what about the two three zone somehow people are playing two three zones against me well let's just look at this really quickly basically we're going up against a slower team so they're probably running a two three zone if you're allowed to run a two three zone at your level of play or in, in your league that you're playing in now if they are running a two three zone this is a nice simple play that you can run I call it the triangle motion and you can run a triangle motion. I've ran other videos like it before as well. However, 
we're going to be switching things up a bit. Player 1 is going to be passing over to player 2. That's going to now have players fill just like this. That's what the defense is probably going to look like. And what we're going to be looking at doing here is have player 4 set a screen for on player 4 red. Player 3 is going to be popping up top. Player 2 is going to be dribbling together. And this will be a double team once until player 2 three gets that ball player two is going to be recovering and player five is going to be setting a screen on player three so now player one is going to be using four and five as a screen and he's going to be popping out to the mid-range or three-point line area where player one is going to get that ball and he's going to jack up that shot now this is a play that has garnered one of my players it was like four threes in a row bang like back to back to back to back four times down the court he was a very good three-point shooter, and this was the grade 8 level, so I know this play works really well at the middle school level. Anyways, I hope that you have enjoyed today's video. I hope that these plays help your team win more games. If they do, let us know in the comment section below, and I'll see you guys again uh, later on today for another basketball video.